by asking the questions. If you've got any situation regarding this, feel free to call up, inshallah ta'ala. We've got our first caller, inshallah ta'ala. Um, salamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. Wa alaikum salam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Okay, sister. Um, what it is, is um, I'd like to ask Brother Abu Muhammad, you know when people go to see these beers, they jump in without doing Salat al mm. Um, I personally have had an experience where I've done Salat al to go and see someone in India, and it came back unfavorable. I was told to open up the visa that was sent to me by him. And the, the tickets for the visa, everything was already prepared. But then when the, the visa were opened, we'd seen that in the Therese there was um, like one man standing with the left hand forward, left foot forward, a last name on the left leg. Also, um, also... Also, when people say, I'm sorry, I can't speak no more. Bismillah, 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 wa salatu wa salamu ala rasulillah. Allahumma la sahla illa ma ja'altahu sahla, wa anta alladhi idha shi'ta tij'al al-hazna sahla. Allahumma sahl, Allahumma sahl. O oh Allah, give her the speech, inshallah. Allahumma, give her the power to continue her speech, ya Allah. Carry on, inshallah. Carry on, inshallah. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum salam. Um, sorry about, about that. Um, but when I'm doing Salat al Istakhara and the Tawiz, I've opened up as well, there were three Tawiza, one for under my pillow, one to carry with me, and the one that I had to carry with me when it was opened up had a face on it with, um, you know like how a noose is around a person's neck? That was on it. It had Firaun's name in it, Abu Jahal's, Haman's, and all this and that. Wow. Um, and this is what I'm curious at, is why do people not do Salat al before going to see somebody? I personally done Salat al to see Brother Abu Muhammad. It was snowing. Everyone told me not to go to see him. It's snowing, you're going to get stuck and everything. And I found that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala opened the doors for my... Um, treatment to be started, alhamdulillah. alhamdulillah. And it's, it's been really good because, alhamdulillah, I can start reading my namaz now. I can start doing good things again. Whereas when it comes back on me is by my own mistake. By I find this time I've made a mistake. See? Oh. And because they don't want me to go to court, and I haven't gone to court, this is my mistake. See, and the jinns themselves have told Brother Abu Muhammad my they sister, are here to prevent me from going to court. My sister, why why they pre prevent you to go to court? Because they do not want me to speak against a brother. So do so do you do do you mean a magician or somebody send this jinn? To block you to speak or to go to court. <laughs> yes, we block. <laughs> you blocked her, ya Adullah. You enemy of Allah. You blocked her, huh? <laughs> but inshallah, Allah Tabaraka wa Taala block you in this dunya, in the akhira. Remember, ya ayyuh al jinn. Remember, inshallah, that you are going to stand before Allah, Yawm Al-Qiyamah, and Allah is going to ask you why you enter this body. 
what you are going to say to Allah Ta'ala يوم القيامة يوم لا ينفع مال ولا بنون إلا من أتى الله بقلب سليم ها What you are going to say to Allah Ta'ala, oh the jinn in that body? No! What you are going to say to Allah Ta'ala? No! What you are going to say to Allah? Are you, are you Muslim or non-Muslim? No! Muslim or non-Muslim? No! Muslim or non-Muslim? No! Who created you? Who created you? Who created you? Who created you and why? Huh? Remember that you are going to stay before Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. You are going to die, yeah? And remember Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, yawm al-qiyamah, he will ask you why you enter the body of that, that lady. What you are going to say to him, Ya Allah, forgive me. The magician is the one who told me, go ruin her life. Go and stop her talking, yes? But it will be late, Allah will send you to Jahannam khalidina fiha. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala mentioned in the Quran, and he said, don't fear them and fear me if you're a believer. وَلَا تَخَافُهُمْ وَخَافُونِ إِن كُنْتُمْ مُؤْمِنِينَ May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala give our sister inshallah, uh, inshallah give her inshallah the strength and give her iman and give her power inshallah that she will get rid of you. And don't worry inshallah you are not strong in the quwwat anillahi jami'ah. The Allah most high, most, most powerful.